incredible. What a set. Pasta. Tuna with pasta. Amazing brother. Come fish it. Good morning my friends. Driving to Alicante starts from early morning. More than like one hour driving already and showing that it's like one more hour to drive. Want to get the registration there, we'll see. Just came back to the car. It looks like uh, I got registration. A lot of documents still need to make, but the first step is already successful. So we'll see. Maybe we'll stay for a while in. Spain. La vida de los adultos en campos de, de desplazados y cárceles bajo el control de las autoridades kurdas en el noreste de Siria se sigue agravando. Sufre la falta de una alimentación adecuada. Yeah. yeah, yeah, hello. This guy study music and live live in the van. We'll go today to Basque, to the city center of Valencia. came to another location in the city center was trying to park but no places so parked over here and uh, after one hour of playing music the police came cannot play with the speaker so bad news Sunday morning Is my neighbors from UK, Italy. Letty, she's she's from Italy. And Kyle, uh, he's from UK. Rice with beans and mackerel. Rice with beans and mackerel. <laughs> mackerel. Uh, who I'm recording, you know, like from. Oh uh, really? In the camper, yeah, exactly. You're the first one. I feel like I'm honored. Nice. If you were drinking alcohol, I would give you this. And this is wine from the region in Italy where I'm from. Oh. My grand, my grandma bring it to me. Oh. So it's she, very she, nice, but you don't. Yeah. You will have a sip. <laughs> Just a sip. <laughs> is it okay? No. <laughs> so this one from IKEA, right? This is from IKEA. And this one from IKEA because this I have from similar. IKEA. Okay, this one from IKEA. And how long does it take for you, how long does it take for you to to make it actually? Two months. Two months. Wait, everything? Yeah. Yeah. Two months? I'll show you. But how? Wait, mm. two months. Wait. For me, I did nothing, and it, it took like. Oh no, this is your phone. Yeah, it took like around maybe three weeks, you know, and I did nothing almost there. Like it's just bad and like stuff. Uh -huh. For uh, you, two months? two months. For everything? Yeah. Every day. Yeah. Yeah. I did similar. It was hard. Yeah. Fuck. I'll show you the picture of her. Fuck. So when two we months. Her... But do, do you have? Uh, yeah, because you have. It was like this, where we bought it. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay. That's what it was it. And, this and right now, in two months. Now. In two months. Mm -hmm. Amazing, guys. To be yeah, honest. because he cannot... Uh, we were building it in Italy. Ah. And he cannot stay in Italy, uh, oh. in Europe, uh -huh. for longer than like three months, like we yeah, were talking yeah, yeah, yeah. this morning. And... Yeah, I like your accent. It's just similar like UK people. <laughs> And so yeah, we had to do it in two months. And after from Italy, we drove to um, UK because this van uh, was registered in Germany. Oh. And we told, we you told bought in Germany? Yes. And then you bring to Italy? Yes. And made there and then came to yeah. UK? Yeah. Because okay. uh, 
of course when we came uh, when we went to Italy mm -hmm. we had an um, um, exportation number plate mm -hmm. so that one there the Pfaffenhausen 392B <laughs> okay and um, we thought that we could have like convert the whole thing uh, in Italy you can no, you cannot. Ah, you cannot. The laws you are, cannot. But the laws like, you cannot. They don't let you do uh -huh. it. You uh -huh. have to go through like uh, companies and engineer. It's a lot of more effort. So we were like, oh, in England it's easy. So, so you went to England and we made it registered there. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it's like right now it's camper. Yeah. It's completely like mm -hmm. by documents. Yeah, so okay. For the England. Uh, but the steering wheel is on the other side. It's like it's like a it's a European van. Ah, yeah, yeah. With an English number plate. Oh. Bought in Germany. Ah, because yeah, it's yeah. from the left side. Bought in, in Germany. In, in, in uh, England, it's from the right side, right? Yeah, with an English number plate. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Oh, that's but, cool. Yeah, it was a lot. And we stayed in England for, we were planning to stay in England for two months. Uh -huh. And we stayed for six, no, five. Mm -hmm. Five months. How much did you pay for, like, for everything? For the like... inside and the material and yeah, everything, yeah, 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 around yeah. Uh, 2,000 euros. So it's not bad. I don't know, like, where did you take this process? Where did you, you made it in we, Italy? We, we made it in Italy, but uh, we, I was very lucky because, for example, my grandpa mm -hmm. knows a person that sells wood. Ah, okay. Because and my, like, for example, like, I don't know, if you see this, 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 this is from my, my brother, mm -hmm. whole, uh, old uh, bedroom. Furniture. Yeah, uh, yeah furniture. Yeah, 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 yeah. They was not used anymore. And they gave, yeah. Oh, I don't okay. know what other example. Well, what would you have? You have fridge as well. Mm -hmm. Fridge, yeah. Okay, I mean, you have because I mean you have a lot of stuff. I think I put, I think I, I bought everything for everything it's around two thousand as well. Oh. I don't know. I didn't buy anything. You know, mm -hmm. it's like just wood. You know, mm -hmm. wood yeah. like instruments, stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. Yeah, because the I, only uh, thing that we spent real real money on was the fridge and the battery. The rest was super yeah. Cheap. How much is the battery? Five hundred. Five hundred. And we got no, we like, got we got a deal, kind of. Five hundred and this one, the six hundred. Six hundred and fifty. So it means that for nine hundred you bought like yeah, all yeah, rest. Yeah. But how is it possible? Like I just like for me. It's only wood, bro. It's only because wood. Because we were buying like panels, and after we were like cutting all everything by ourselves. Same. So, you know, like, same. 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 Oh. But we got given like this is from Georgia. All of this is from. Yeah, we, we got, got a lot of wood and a lot of like, material from. My family. Mm, okay, they that's were, why, you, know, you know, like when they come to you and be like, "Oh yes, we have two panels of wood, like in the garage, and they always be yeah. in there." I mean, if I there. if I do it at home, I know that this will be like for me nothing, you know, yeah. because yeah. I can exactly. buy everything. Yeah, I don't need to buy, for example, wood stuffs. I can find out. Yeah. Okay. And, and that's that's what like every like this we bought new, this we bought new, mm. but all the rest is all like recycled kind of thing oh. from my family and from. The people that gave us to to us, and we were very. And how very do you lucky. sleep? You sleep this way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this. This way, you know. He it's has short, to like sleep short. like that. Maybe they're and gonna right? Because... What is your what is your height? Your height. One. Um, in centimeters, I don't know. One hundred and eighty. One hundred eighty. Yeah. Two. And three. You I don't know. One. One sixty-seven. Okay. So I fit perfectly. In it. but you see, because this uh, was all a wall. Mm -hmm. Right here we made. Yeah, you made this. I see. I see that you. So made. now it's like that. We made the little holes. So because yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, you have more. So we can fit. We can fit with. I think it's the other two. side. Yeah, there we go. Mm -hmm. So there and the hole here there and the hole there. There are two holes, so, uh -huh. so can there fit. is more you can space. Fit. Yeah. You can fit. Because if it was just like this, is the wall of uh, the van. Mm -hmm. um, if it was just like this, it would not fit at all. But you can right now, or not? I mean, just, if you go there, not just directly. Yeah. Okay, but so it was before the car, before this car. Yeah, mm -hmm. Right now, you choose this one. Right now, much more space. But I mean, to be honest, I told you, like, as well, you know, if if you live and one, one lifestyle and stuff, like, yeah, this is the best so far because here's like, it's kind of like perfect room, you know, you can yeah. do whatever you want and yeah. They're like nothing. That's yeah. why. You before need... the white van, before before the New Zealand van, I lived in a car. Ah. Not even a van. Just a normal car. Yeah. For how long? Uh, for uh, like a four by four, like a off road. Yeah, car. but for how long did you live there? Um, Where? Yeah. Come, come, come. Eleven months. 
11 months. Uh -huh. Man. Oh, the results will turn down. Yeah. Just like. Uh huh. I just get, press. Yeah. Okay, I got it. And take. you, yeah, lift that. Yeah, I got it. I got it. And it should be fine. Yeah. There we go. 11 months? What did you leave? Like in. Uh, Australia. In Australia, 11 months in, one, in the car. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was amazing. In Australia, but how, like, what did you do there? I cannot imagine. Um, enjoy, enjoy meals. Drove <laughs> from Melbourne to Darwin, oh. all the way around. And take, and took like. I stopped to work for a few, for three months in one place, one month or two months in the other place, mm -hmm. one month here, one month there. So it wasn't all. But did you work like in different mm -hmm. cities as well? Mm -hmm. So you did, what did you do? What kind of job you did? <laughs> all sorts of jobs. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was a bus driver. Bus driver. Mm -hmm. I oh. made roads. Uh -huh. um, but you just do part time or like right? So how you do? Like I would, yeah, I turn up. Oh. And they say, do you want to work? I say, yeah. But for like, I mean, do you need to have a contract like no. for a year or something? No. Oh. No. And then you just say, oh, guys, I'm leaving. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. Or they go and I stay. Oh. Okay. So I was a bus driver. I did concrete. I did roads. Concrete. I did what is concrete? Um, cement. Um, cement. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, I did it for free, you know, for my parents, like we did. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For, for for many years. Yeah, that's how I know what it is. I worked in a hostel. I was a cleaner. Uh huh. And then I was a cowboy. You were a cowboy. Mm -hmm. That's where we met. Yeah. You was a cowboy as well. It was. A, <laughs> no, I was a cook for the cowboys. Oh, but I mean, what what did you do? Riding horse or no. With um, quad bikes, uh -huh. or um, you know, a Toyota Land Cruiser. Yeah. Mm, in them, you drive four hours away into uh -huh. the middle of nowhere in Australia. So yeah. everything is nothing. Yeah. You drive four hours out. You build a like a funnel, and then four helicopters come, and they fly around, find the cows. They're wild. They've never seen humans before. Oh wait! So it's like. You need to catch, catch yeah, them. yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. catching what they've never seen humans before, and then we catch them. It was, yeah. Like, I don't know. It's like, but how? Wait. Let me show you. It's <laughs> is crazy. Wait, you ca you come to the like dessert somewhere mm -hmm. like, for so for our drive. So the old top of like um, Australia mm -hmm. is pretty much um, desert. So yeah. like, yeah. you know, the yeah. middle yeah. bit yeah. is yeah. desert exactly. and the North Territory is the top bit mm -hmm. where it's like a tropical like kind of environment and um, there is nothing in it. There is just like this little town in the middle of nothing where there is a petrol station and Aboriginal community. The Aboriginal is like the native people that like own the land mm -hmm. and after English people came by and took everything. <laughs> as always um but um so we end up there both of us because in new Ze in australia it works that uh you have one year of working holiday visa mm -hmm. so working holiday you can work you can do holiday so no one cares. You, can like you can do one year but if you do 88 days of farm work for the community for like everything 88 years 88, 88 days. days yes it's like sorry. three months mm -hmm. three months uh they give you another year oh that's why exactly you're so smart. I pretty much know. all the people all the the young people that you they see at one farm. point are gonna be like okay i'm going into farm uh -huh. so they and give an extra year huh? yeah okay and they give you an extra year and i like before going uh into work in into the farm i was picking peaches up and you would you were picking broccoli Zucchini. Zucchini. <laughs> Zucchini. And it's just like, you know, like you just live in the farm. They do pay you. They do give you like, most places they give you a place where to stay yeah, and yeah. they give you meals and everything. But and yeah. it's very, it's very nice. Um, but somehow we end up in this, my peach uh, picking was not working very well. So um, we have to uh, close the farm because they were not growing. And mm. I found this job on Facebook and I was like yeah okay I'm going and we just met there and I was met the cook. cowboy <laughs> met the cowboy, <laughs> cowboy yeah the real cowboy so how you need to catch like how how how, how was the this is one so he's never seen a human before mm -hmm. and I'd gotten round the thing round the horns 
and I've got the rope. Um, but normally. But cow from the like from desert. Desert, yeah, wild, completely yeah. wild. Yeah, Because normally horses, right? Or is this one is just. Mm. In Australia, there's there's, horses, yeah, there's horses, buffalo, oh. cows, donkeys. Okay. Donkeys, yeah. Oh. So many donkeys. It's so big, and if if two cows escape, now you've got a thousand cows. A hundred years ago, two cows escaped. Now there's cows everywhere. Two two donkeys escaped. Hundred years ago, now there's donkeys everywhere. Mm. So, and they're not very good for, because they're not native. They have to catch them. Mm. So it's either we catch them and, and sell them, or the government catches them and kills them. So yeah, yeah, of course, it's they bad. catch them. But governments, like, I mean, you do good things for government as well, because, right? We didn't. We just sold them. Mm. Mm. But do they pay or not? Like if you catch or like government just no no no. Do you, you you get the cow? It's your cow. Okay, mm. if you catch, mm. but do your you have cow. license or like do you need to lead license? You know, um, I don't license? know. You don't know. I just did what I was told. He said go go. go. <laughs> okay. We're just okay. okay. We're just crazy. Yeah. They were not men of many words. They no. were just like you do that, do that. That's it. Mm. It was like going back in time. Yeah. Very far west. If you watch like a far yeah. west movie, is that yeah. you know, like with the thing like rolling around the street, like yeah. of hay and blah, blah, just like that. And people with big hats, completely fat, mm -hmm. and be like, rah, 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 rah. and you have to understand them. It's crazy. Mm. It was crazy. There you have storage right there. Yeah. Mm. If it's from from another side. You yeah. open the. Down there we have um well the electrical electrical, ah, electrical. system thing. What are you talking about? Storage down there. Oh, we said stories. And we have the water tank. There is 120 liters uh -huh. uh, uh, water tank, and we have the bikes, rollerblades, and a lot of extra stuff there. things. We have a kayak in there too. Mm. We have all sorts of things. It's like a um, inflatable kayak. Oh, I don't know. You know the one that like you pump up. Ah, right? okay. They, they, yeah, yeah, they I got, I got. Like that. Um, okay. It's quite easy because you can fold it up. And exactly, it because it's not much space it takes, okay. But yeah, we have all sorts of things. But how about the electricity? What did you do like here? What is electricity? It's a lot easier than it looked from the start. No, but um, is it... Uh, solar. Solar panels mm -hmm. have as well. The battery was 500. Huh? The battery was 500. Way, this yeah. is super simple. There's nothing like it doesn't look like a new camper van. It doesn't look like yeah. like a factory made camper van. I mean like But people, that, but that's what people do. People spend lots of money to make it look like that. Mm. And the solar panels and the battery, there's nothing in here electrical. It's just the lights, the mm. fridge and to charge your phone. That's it. It's, it's, not, it's like, not much stuff. Some people have this electrical, ah, yeah, yeah, and the water yeah. pump. And some people have I think I mostly know. it's like fridge which takes, right? Yeah. Mm, that's why we spent mm. a lot of money on yeah, it because yeah, yeah. now it doesn't take anything. Yeah. But I mean, it's super important for me. I find out like fuck electricity because I mean I have a lot of stuff where I need to charge and mm -hmm. like all the time I need to go somewhere like and it's headache. Yeah. With fridge and running water, mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. a completely different thing. Almost one year in in, in just normal car, of course, mm. you know. It was difficult. Yeah, I know. It's what good is fun it? though. But I, for me, I'm staying like much less than you. Mm. Six months and it's like. Mm. Australia is different. It it's is. easier. Mm -hmm. than it's here. made for it. Yeah, because it's hotter. Ah, uh, yeah, because the weather is yeah. way hotter. Mm -hmm. Too hot, but you don't have to be sneaky. You know, like you don't have to be hidden away here. You can just sleep. So everybody. Yeah, fine. yeah. They, because they in really Europe, care. in general, it's like yeah, it's a nightmare. But how yeah. about the safety there in uh, Australia as well? Better than here. Yeah. Better than here. Mm. Well, yeah, yeah, it is. But you know, uh, we were talking um, about the other day that here in Europe, mm -hmm. um, you know, when you open up the door, this door, like for example, the side door, uh, in Australia and New Zealand, it's very normal to see people like just chilling in the van and like with the doors open and just be like, oh, hi, uh, like that. But here, it feels a bit more. It's forced, you yeah, know, like yeah, because yeah. people like usually go like with the camper vans like that, Someone and they the just camper. close themselves mm -hmm. in. On the camper, yeah. But for me, that's not that's not what it's about, you know. Like exactly. I park here, but even this morning, like there was the woman asking me coffee. I give you coffee, like yeah. I don't care. I give you a whole breakfast if you ask me to, <laughs> yeah. you know. Like it's all about 
like meeting up with people that like just love to travel and all exactly. that. Exactly. And I feel like here in Europe is a bit more cold. Exactly. Um, exactly. Exactly. Than than like what it was in in Australia, New Zealand. Uh, because there are people I think get used to you know. Mm. But here yeah. they do, but as well, I think yeah, they're more close. Uh, to be honest, like, uh, yeah, there are not much people like which I met. Mm -hmm. I mean, I met like different, but not much, to be mm -hmm. honest. During this, like, all the trips, I didn't meet much people on the campus as well. Mm -hmm. It's normal in New Zealand to yeah. do this. That's why, like, that's why, that's why, just disappear for the weekend is completely normal. Whereas you see. here, when I left the UK, I was like, whoa, what are you doing? Whoa, yeah, whoa. yeah, yeah. yeah. But mm. safety, you see, like uh, I told you, uh, I don't know, in general, it's not safe. Mm. Uh, you don't have any incidents so far, like so far, no. Okay. But you know what? Um, we wanted to go in a lot of cities in uh, the south of France, like Marseille. And you want Lyon, to go to Marseille? And all of that. <laughs> and you know, you probably use it too. Like there is a app that's called uh, Park for a Night. I'm using it like all the time, you know, exactly. during the last six months. And you know, we were looking at it and all the parking spots were like, we got robbed, we got robbed, yeah. we got robbed, we got robbed. In Marseille or where? So in Marseille, like all Everywhere. the city, like the big cities in the south of Spain. And it's just like, it's very bad because like we had to skip it completely. Yeah. We, of course we cannot go there because what about if, yes, I park here and after I go for a walk and I feel like, what about if they're going to break in in my house and yeah. like take exactly. everything, exactly. you know, like this everything if you I've If got. you have everything here, so yeah. you will be worried. That's why like what happens with me when I came to Barcelona, you know, I came, I checked already, like I even didn't w want to go there, but it was the best spot and I was crossing, you know, because I was from, went from Valencia to uh well, from valencia to uh, france and then like uh, to switzerland yeah to geneva so yeah. it was on my way and i thought okay like a lot of people were saying like it's the best city to bask as well i said okay mm -hmm. i just came there and it was uh, i parked maybe like it's on the park somewhere yeah i have video about it <laughs> and uh, the parking the parking lot was like seven kilometers from the city center, so it's not city center. Mm -hmm. It's city center. I, I, like I'm not. I don't want to talk because it's there. Yeah. Everywhere it's like just the worst uh, comments. When I came there, uh, I just uh, tried to walk around and just see because I mean I already know like okay I need to check this this this. And on this parking lot, it was around maybe twenty spots mm -hmm. for cars. Mm -hmm. Two of them was with broken glass. So it's good city to visit, but with yes. camper like, and so much all the almost comments. And Marcel, I yeah. heard from the <laughs> French people, is the best city. I said like, okay, it's the yeah. best city yeah. to mm. visit. No, Valencia people. is nicer than Barcelona. Really? Yeah, I've been to Barcelona. Oh. I've been to Barcelona because when we were in England, mm -hmm. um, it was my birthday, and my brother is in Barcelona, mm -hmm. so I flew to Barcelona okay. um, to meet him. Um, and my best friend came over too and I went around the city without a van just like walking mm. like a tourist yeah. and walking around blah, blah, and it just feels so too much too much you a lot, of, a lot like, of tourists no it's too much everything mm -hmm. it's like it's too much people it's too much going on around you it confuses you and it's just like you never know where you actually are and mm -hmm. uh, when here in Valencia is we've been here for like two days and we didn't never use that map yeah. you know we were able to come back here like with our map or nothing okay and that means a lot to me that means that like you just feel comfortable the traffic in valencia city is the worst so far where i was really driving the worst if you're the driving the city, yeah the, the organization of traffic like how you move you know mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's like i confused like it happens first time for me like what the fuck i mean you have like a uh, roundabout or something right mm -hmm. what is the name mm -hmm. and there is like four lines and from here you need to go like for example this way yeah you need to cross all of them like and, <laughs> and people come here this is the best like this. secret place so far which we need to see always and there is like this and there is a event here oh you, you have your your ventilation okay ah, okay so Simple here it goes the What's the name of this thing so that i got it i got it yeah I, so it's like uh, from the yeah it's from the wood yeah, the, the, the so you do the, the, the poo, and mm. here you do the pee, and after you just like lift it up like that. Yeah, okay. And just take it out. You take it out, mm. and 
doing like this I think is... it's the best one, you know, because you can store like anywhere in the south. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. If I'm in the desert or something it's, like it's that, not a problem. I can still do that yeah. without being exactly. a massive deal. Exactly. But the and chemical stuff is different. Exactly. exactly. You can't... You can't uh, exactly, you just need to find out the toilet where you can stroll, you know, yeah, where yeah, you can yeah. like yeah. not stroll, but you... Yeah, and I don't want to do like that. Like, That's what I'm saying. Dry poo seems a lot nicer than... Everything mixed together with the blue yeah. stuff. Yeah. Exactly, exactly. And it smells, man. Yeah. It smells. Yeah. We had one in New Zealand in the in the small van because it's like by law you have to have a toilet. Oh. Um, but we never used it. In like one, two years of having the van, never ever used it. Oh. You see, I think it, of course it depends where you're traveling because for example, if you all the time in the nature, like whatever, I mean like... Yeah. Who cares? But if you're in the city staying, like it's a nightmare because sometimes yeah. like, okay, you need like, yeah, yeah. if you can keep it the eyes yeah. but if you're but you know like it's mainly like pee because like i cannot go like, even this morning when we woke up and there were all the people walking yeah well, and the, running no, to, oh yeah. my god yeah, exactly <laughs> but you know like you cannot go there and piss exactly now you can yes because it's night time yeah, yeah. But uh, that, that's why this is for like emergencies yeah. like that because yeah. if you're in a natural like you yeah. said who cares you just go for it it's a normal it's normal it's like, yeah exactly it, it's okay but now it's mainly when you're in the cities or you have an emergency yeah. but it's always it's better to have a than not have a i mean if you don't have like okay but you need yeah well, and it doesn't take any space this is quite smart it's, it's just good like, because yeah because you can sit as well yeah for mine i'm yeah i'm not using it but i'm using it as like you just put something or sit mm -hmm. something yeah <laughs> yeah no it's good so both yesterday went uh, to the meeting with the Ukrainians. After that, uh, on my way back home, was told by police car. It was two officers. Like they start to check the information about me. They ask for a passport, then registration. After that, they start to check my bag. As far as I know, they cannot do it without two people and without uh, writing the documents because uh, they don't have any evidence that I did something like crime or something. Proper nice camera. <laughs> yeah. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> this window. Well, you are. This is Croatia. Yeah, the morning should start like that. 